All right, welcome to Mr. Infinity Disrupting Fitness Studios. I just want to take today and just spend some time to show you what I've been working on as far as products. So the Mr. Infinity Shogun line, as you know, if you've been following me, we always expand and we always want to really push out the latest, the best cutting edge products to the marketplace. And so this next product that we are launching is the VMO Pro. And me and knees over toes guys really focusing on knees and really want to make the best products for anybody in the world can train their knees anywhere. So it goes here and it goes here. And so this is the height that you want it. And you always want it facing forward. You want these hooks facing forward when, you, when you're on there. And so this is the height, this is called a Patrick step up. And this is what Ben knees over toes guy kind of coined then Patrick, Patrick step up. And you just kind of control going down, coming up. And so what that does is give you anchor mobility and put tension on that VMO. So as you come here, you push that knee forward. You got that ankle mobility here. You drop that heel down and you drive up. So control it, drive up, control it, drive up. And then you do both legs. The goal is at this height, your body weight, 10 times each leg. So I'll just kind of do just a little demonstration as you control it coming down, drive up, control it coming down, drive up. And this board is manufactured to take up to 500 pounds. So anybody that's really crazy, strong with one leg, just let me know. But 500 pounds would probably do it. So you really just kind of control coming down, drive up, try not to double tap like I just did. So you want to control coming down, drive up, control, push that knee forward, drive up. So that's really healthy for your knees. So that's just a quick, quick demonstration. The VMO Pro, it goes here. And then all you have to do is pull, pull this back. And now it is set up to do infinity step ups here taking the ankle out of it, or you can do your squats. Or you can do the hamstring stretches. So everything you can do with the VMO board. This is a VMO Pro, so you can incorporate different exercises all in one, and it's adjustable. You can take it anywhere with you really lightweight, things like seven pounds. So just wanted to show you that real quick. Let me show you another quick exercise that you can do with it. So another thing you can do with this board is take the Nordic strap, put it around your, your foot. That's another bonus. This board is called a VMO Pro, still adjustable. In which a lot of, right now we get a lot of competition and a lot of people that's trying to copy us in the market for these VMO boards. You won't see this in the market. The wooden models, it's just different. I'm not gonna knock the wooden models, but they're not adjustable like this and they're not as practical. It can't break down. Sometimes you see these boards and they have like a lip on them and I would, I would go against getting a VMO board like that because you want to be able to put your foot down here and really control it and coming up to really put tension on there. If you got a lip on, you're not able to do that. And so even, even on a squat, you want to be able to put your feet down, slightly down there, and then really keep that chest up, control it down, and driving up. So in my opinion, I know I'm biased, but this is the ideal VMO board. And now we have a VMO Pro with the perfect height, close to six inches. And that's all you need to really get that flexibility in the ankle and the tension in that quad as you come up for that step up. That's the latest Mr. Affinity Shogun product. The next one is the tibialis bar. So the tib tibs, as you guys know, you've been following me, is your first line of defense when you're walking, when you're running, when you're jumping. And that's really important. A lot of people develop shin splints. A lot of people develop knee pain because they never train this tibialis muscle. And so this is a, a, a product we have on the market. I actually have a new advanced version of this tib bar coming soon. But this is really simple. You just kind of push it here. 
out. You can control it coming down. Really make sure you get that stretch to that ankle and those tibialis and just kind of come up. So down, stretch, come up, down, stretch, come up, squeeze at the top. Every time I've been on the road traveling. So it's going to be good to get back in here and really get back on all these exercises because you really create the length and the strength at the same time. So that's the key. This next wave of fitness, this west wave of training is not just strength building and it's not just flexibility. It's really incorporating both the flexibility and the strength together. You know, so you see all these yogis stretching, 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 which is a great thing. And you see all these bodybuilders and these big guys lifting, lifting, lifting. But incorporating both, and we figure out the science of the best way to do, they incorporate both. And so that's where the kind of these products come into play at, you know. So that's our goal with the Mr. Infinity Shogun brand is to really bring products to the marketplace that allow people to get that, able to get that strength and flexibility really from anywhere. You can take these products anywhere to really with you. They're very practical. I was just traveling in Thailand. I brought, pretty much brought all these products with me. So this is a regular VMO board here. Same thing. You can do all these, all these stretches with it. Squats, step ups. The best thing, the great thing about this Nordic strap is it's a triple flexion. So it's triple flexion meaning you can work through your ankles, you work through your knees, and you work through your hips. So I showed you where the hips, I showed you working through your hips, and now I'm gonna show you working through this ankle. So I showed you the tibialis raise with the tib bar. Now I'm gonna show you, it's a little light for me, but I'll still show, be able to show you. Still getting that stretch, and then really working through that ankle. I'm telling you, I used to have, I used to always sprain my ankle in college. I used to play college basketball, always sprain my ankle. But one thing I never did was create mobility, and I never create strength in my ankle. So they have you, they have you in college. I don't know if they still do it, but they had me wearing ankle braces. We had to wear ankle braces, and we had to get our ankles taped. And that made our, our ankles even weaker. That's like, that's basically like having a crutch. And they never gave us exercise like this to really strengthen and create mobility in that ankle. This is the second thing you can do with this triple flexion Nordic strap. You saw the hips, you saw the ankle, and now I'll show you, I'm, I'll put this to the side and I'll show you the knee. And so it's, it's extremely important. This exercise I'm gonna show you here it's extremely important because your ligaments and tendons behind that knee is what protects the front of your knee. And so this exercise called the Nordic is pretty much almost the only exercise that really trains and strengthens those ligaments and tendons behind your knee. I'm gonna show you how anybody can just get started. I recommend elevating those hips. You kind of get your feet in there. And you see, I'm doing all this stuff by myself too, so it's not like I need, you need anybody's help. So you just lock yourself in. I recommend when you're starting out using this Nordic strap, this triple flexion Nordic strap, is you just kind of resist coming down. And as you resist coming down, just kind of play around with it, really feeling those hamstrings fire up and feeling these ligaments and tendons fire up behind that knee. So kind of just control it coming down and just kind of push, push yourself up every time. So I recommend anybody kind of start and just really working with eccentrics. Eccentrics meaning coming down slow and just kind of push yourself up. And so that, what that is gonna do, that's really gonna train those hamstrings, it's gonna train those ligaments and tendons that's gonna protect your knee and prevent you from having an ACL, an MCL, or a meniscus tear. Engage those glutes, squeeze those glutes, those hips forward, and just kind of fight coming down, fight, fight, fight. And then once you get good at, at that, you'll get more comfortable and you can just explode coming up. So just kind of fight, 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 fight. Explode coming up. So that explosion coming up is where you're jumping, that one foot jumping, the, um, the sprinting, 
those hamstrings, that, that power is when you're coming up. But the structural changes is when you're coming down. So you fight coming down, fight, 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 fight. Bang, coming up. And as you get better, you'll come down, you'll get a little lower. Coming up, and the lower you go, the harder, the harder it is. So the triple flexion Nordic strap is probably one of the best purchases. I think it's going for like $34, $39 right now. But your ankle, your knee, and your hip all with one product. It's priceless, you know, your health is priceless. And that's what we try to do. We try to just create products that everybody needs, everybody can use. The next is Mr. Finney Shogun floss band. So floss bands are a tool that I use on my ankles, I use on my elbows, and primarily on your knees. So if you're new, if you're new to this type of training and you don't know about flossing, flossing is a modality that it's really kind of almost like blood flow restriction. And so as you restrict blood flow in this area, if you have tendonitis, if you have any kind of knee problems, what, what heals anything in life is oxygen and blood flow. Oxygen and blood flow. If you want to heal yourself, go out and do some deep breathing, get around nature and, and let that heal you. We're going to force oxygen and blood flow with flossing. And so they call this voodoo because it's almost a magical exercise. So you start with the red band below your knee. You kind of make sure you, you get it on there tight. So remember, man, if you, always, anyone, if you ever want to heal yourself, let oxygen and blood flow. You can do that through fasting. You can do that through deep breathing. You can get, do that by getting around nature, getting around trees. And this flossing, man, I swear I used to have crazy knee pain. And when I started doing this consistently, it's almost like my knees were able to breathe again. It, it created space in there that I didn't really realize that I needed. And so they call it voodoo for a reason. You put the heavier, the, the, the more top band is the black band, the looser band is the red band. And you put the black band on top, the red band on the bottom. And I recommend putting this VMO board. And you can just start. Just simple, simple, just kind of going here and just kind of push yourself up, kind of staying in that range, kind of hit as deep as you can, coming up, deep as you can, coming up, deep as you can, coming up. And then once you, once you, if you don't need that, if you don't need to hold on, you just kind of come all the way down, come all the way up. I would say get like 20 squats in. And once you get 20, 20 good solid squats in, you just take it off. And this is something you could do before a basketball game, before uh, an event, before you're about to run. Uh, and I'm telling you, man, you'll make, you make a, a big difference. You know, I like to say 0 .0001. Try to get 0 .001 better in anything you do. If you want an extra edge before you play, if you want to jump a little higher, get to that ball, just feel a little better on the court or on that field of play. Floss. Even if you feel like your knees will feel good, like right now, just, just doing that, I feel like I got a lot more mobility in my knees. So you can do both knees. If you got a problem with one knee, you can just start with one knee. So flossing, floss band is the next product. So we went through the VMO Board Pro, the tip, tip bar, we call it the tip crusher, the regular VMO, the VMO Board, the Nordic Triple Flexion, Nordic Strap, the floss bands. Next, we'll take you over here. We're gonna look at the sled strap, released about two weeks ago. And so, as you know, reverse sleds are the foundation of our program. Probably the easiest way to transition into getting your knees healthy, getting blood flow in that area. So flossing, reverse sled. Even if you just floss and did reverse sleds every day, you'll, you'll have, your knees will be 90% better. And so, we got the 0 .001 on there to kind of remind you to get a little bit better every day. Compound interest takes hold. Another thing we got on there is winning now. That's me and my dual fours. We just talked about, man, that's, that's the game right there. Winning now, that's all you really can do. You know what I mean? Only now exists, so stay focused and be grateful for the present. And so we just want to give you little reminders and give you a great product, which is really, like I said, a heavy duty strap that can pull tons. The last Mr. Infinity Shogun product is 
Right now, the sled strap, you see what we're working on in here? We got the sled coming your way soon. So shout out Shogun Sports, man. We really trying to make a change in, in the fitness in this landscape and really give people quality products that um, are practical, that you can take anywhere with you. I, I literally just came from Thailand. I took my sled strap, I took my VMO board, took my floss bands, took my Nordic strap, took my tip bar. I took pretty much every product and was able to kind of just train from my hotel with these products. So it's practical, it's convenient, and it serves a big purpose in the health of my body, which is everything to me. Those are the Mr. Finney Shogun products. And now onto just the Mr. Finney products. Let me show you what we got here. I've been wearing this out, but you got the red reverse squat strap, the black reverse squat strap, and maybe, maybe you guys knew, so you might not know what a reverse squat strap is. So reverse squat is the opposite of a squat. So when you squat and you're really working through those glutes and those hamstrings and in an in uh, underrated muscle group a lot of people don't use work is their hip flexors and being able to pick those legs up. So you want to be able to pick those legs up. And I'll just show you. So this product here allows you to pick those legs up better and be more efficient. So you just control it going out, jump in. Control it going out, jump in. And so what this does is trains those hip flexors and those abdominals in concert with one another. And so it's not just doing a crunch, it's just not doing a, a leg raise. You're training your abdominals, your low abs, and your upper abs, and hip flexors all in concert with, with one another. And so what I recommend is you go all the way out, control it, and try to come all the way in, picking those hips up to really gauge those low abs. So all the way in, control it. All the way in, dry those hips up. Dry those hips up. Control it going out. Jump in, control it, dry those hips up. So I'm telling you, this, this product here, reverse squat strap, you can get from MrInfinity.com, is essential if you really want to be a cut above as an athlete. You know, it's separation season. The red reverse squat strap, right now this is coming with a six-pack program. So you get a free six-pack program with this red reverse squat strap. I mean, it's a hell of a deal. I sell that, the, the, the six-pack program for $200. So same thing, you can do one leg, double leg, Reverse crunch, Usain Bolt exercise, a lot of different things. Actually, let me just kind of show you, just so you, just so I won't have questions when I drop this YouTube. So you saw me do the double leg, single leg. You kind of curl up, engage those abdominals. Still got a little weight on there, so it's gonna be a challenge. So you just kind of control it, control it going now. Drive it in, control it going now. Drive it in, control it going now. Control it, drive it in. So that's the single leg, reverse crunch. You really wanna go real light when you do these reverse crunches. Really just isolating those lower abdominals. So what you do here, you can kind of hold on and you kind of just dry those hips up, pause at the top, control it. Right when you get back to 90, right when that tailbone hits the ground, you come right back up and squeeze. Control it, drive up, squeeze. Control it, drive up, squeeze, control it. Drive up, squeeze. So that's the reverse crunch. Another thing you can do with this is the Usain Bolt. You can either elevate these hands or you can just be in a basic push-up position. I'll come out just a little bit so I can get some grip. Keep those abdominals engaged and just drive that knee in. Control it, control it going out. Push that glute up, squeeze those glutes. Drive that knee in, control it, hips up. Dry that knee in. And if you're an athlete, you know how important that motion is from running for jumping. Being able to dry that knee up. I also use it as to do face pulls. So come in here. You do face pulls with this. Really get those elbows back, chest up. So face pulls with the reverse strap. Another thing I do with the reverse squat strap is single arm rows. So you hear, I got a little heavy, a little weight on there. So you keep that chest up and come, that elbow, that thumb to that chest, control it out. Thump to that chest, coming out. 
one on row. Last thing that I do with this, I'm telling you, it's, it's so practical. This is what I do. It's called a cable power raise. And so I still put both hands in. And it's almost great using it with this strap because it's so adaptable. It's not, it's not rigid like some of these uh, handles that I have. So you keep that chest up, relax that shoulder, extend that arm straight out. And you just come straight out just like that. Control it coming in. Reach that arm across. You kind of want to go light with this because this is a really a long lever, especially with my long arms. You come all the way out, squeeze. So that's a power raise you do with this reverse squat strap. So went through all my practical fitness products that continue to kind of keep pumping out cutting edge products that's going to be able to really change the way you feel, you know? And I think as you feel, you attract. And if you want a healthy body, healthy mind, as above, so below. You know, I'm going to do poor say I'm too spiritual, so I'm going to stop it right there. You know what I'm saying? So next is I have a .00 run bracelet. And that's, I'm saying the people I get these to, hey, I didn't realize how just seeing this .0001 on their bracelet empowers them to just get out of that quick rut they're in. All I got to do is just get .00. I gotta win. All I got to do is win the now. All I got to do is just win right now. Don't worry about what happened in the past. Don't worry about what you got to do. All I got to do is get 0.0001% better right now. And so that's kind of the reason why I made these bands. This is a reminder, like, listen, compound interest, let, the, let, let it work as magic. Compound interest is the eighth wonder of the world. If you take one penny and double it, 31 days, you'll have $10 million. And so through a lifetime, if you just get 0.001% better every day, You'll have a $10 million body. You'll have a $10 million relationship. you have a $10 million spirit. If you just focus on the now and it's getting 0.001% better every day. We get pushed, this, this social media and everything coming at us right now. It's like, man, you got to have this house. You got to have a yacht. You got to have this beautiful relationship. If you, know, if you don't do this, if you don't do that. And so we, it's easy for us to think we got to jump a mile a day. And it, it drives people crazy because I'm, I'm not there. I and mean, you get in this competition mindset instead of just staying focused on your point zero zero run, running your race, playing your game, and getting a little bit better for you and your reality, your dream, your illusion every day. And so that's kind of why I created these point zero zero one bracelets. And it's a uh, rose gold, really cool. I kind of designed this myself. And so that's the next product. Uh, the last one is this. Fitted, handmade um, shirt that I'm selling right now. Dios no TNA religion, which means God has no religion. That's just me. That's my thing. If you know me, if you kind of know my philosophy, man, we all one. We all interconnected, and it's all love. So this here is basically imagination. I feel like everything is, is your imagination, and you are capable of anything you allow your imagination to dream and think of. You know, if you, if you think it, you can become it. And so use your imagination to create your reality for you. You know, you either, you're either creating or you're being created. I think we all are designed to be creators, you know. So that's kind of why I, I created this shirt to realize, man, this is, this is your world. This is your dream. Create the way, this reality the way you want to create it, you know. And so sometimes when you think something's outside of you, external forces are like affecting you, you know, it's easy to kind of like get pushed into a corner. And so once you realize, man, you had the power to point zero zero one your way to the top, you know, so that's kind of why this shirt, this shirt is, is it's a fitted shirt. I kind of had it. So if you out of shape, this might not be the shape, this shirt for you, because it's going to be fitted here at the body and give a little space in the chest. So it's a handmade shirt that I, I had. So it's only have a select amount of them. So if you into this, if you need a shirt, shout out you. So I appreciate you. So check me out on my website, MrFinity.com. You can find all my products. But yeah, I appreciate you tuning in. I'm going to drop this. If you got comments, please comment. If you got any suggestions about products you think you want to see in the market, let me know. But uh, yeah, me and Forrest, man, we just want to drop this and we out. Appreciate you. <laughs> Boy, you always doing that, man. <laughs> yeah.